Welcome back, everybody. I'm Sam. This is Rob. And we are playing XCOM UFO Defense on the PlayStation 1. Uh, Virgil just shot an alien right in the face because he believed. And Igor is bleeding out on the ground and shot his buddy in the back with a rocket. Which is unfortunate, but, you know, he's probably not going to live anyway, so he doesn't have to live with himself. As right. As having Unless that was the only aliens. That's possible. It might be. Oh, yeah. I didn't it's have my a, turn yet. It's an it's... early UFO. Uh, so the, the chances do exist that all there was was tank killer alien and the other guy. It's possible. I think most of your guys are out of time units, except for the ones in the U in the Sky Ranger. Yeah. Get those guys mobilized. I love how everybody has the same hot spot of you step out of the UFO and hide behind that wheel. Oh yeah. Stand behind rocket guy. <laughs> this is probably a wise choice. Ah, the rocket launcher is empty now. True. Turn that way. <laughs> so when rocket launcher guy gets dropped, he can shoot. Well, that, no, that's that way he can. He gets shot at. He's hiding behind the guy who's already got smoked anyway. Right. No, I get you. Do it doesn't get experience for like. That is a possibility. I would bet that I'm gonna guess there's more aliens left and that they're inside. Yep, all playing up themselves in the middle. So here comes uh, another load screen that will be shortened into a montage by by Mark. Well, that was a quick load. Mark probably didn't even have to montage it. And you know what? There might be just one alien in there. Igor is still alive. Oh. I don't know how, but he is. I have to assume they're, they're sitting inside. Yeah. Going hee hee. He is most definitely still inside that space. Oh, that's fine. He is going to be uh, in the either in the center room... Uh, the potential lies oh, he could yeah. be he could be waiting right inside the door for you too. That's true. They like it to like you open the door and you get blasted. I don't need that. But what happened? Move on, Virgil. You're the hero today. Actually the other guy would be pretty good too. Yeah. Oh. Was he Spanky Pants number one? I took it back because he redeemed himself. Mm. He doesn't need to go back to pod six. I believe he is one of your like better shots on the team. Look at that. Let's take a look at this guy. That's um, He has one fatal wound and three health left. So yeah. next turn Look at firing accuracy four. Oof, he's, next he's turn he is going to fall unconscious. And in three turns he'll be dead? I think so. I kinda want him to you know, stay alive. Yeah, well, so it wouldn't be a to, bad thing. So he can live with the pain he's inflicted. We're gonna, we'll make him tell the soldier timelines. It was <laughs> me, I'm sorry. I shot a rocket up his ass. I'll try harder next time. Okay. Deserving time. Oh, you're getting gutsy. All right, now is the time that alien opens the door and throws a grenade. No grenades. The alien grenades are even worse, too. Oh, gosh. They're so strong, too. I never research them, ever. Because then they continue to give you extra points as alien artifacts. Oh, oh yeah, I suppose. I never even thought of that. I just... I'm never going to use them, so why research them? Same with plasma pistols. That's true. Why? Never gonna use them. Things to research. Okay. 
Let's as far this. as that goes, oh, going into cutscene. Cut oh. Well, it's quick. So there's just one inside that spaceship waiting to blast somebody as they come through that door. Oh. Not yet. <laughs> oh, he's gonna be waiting on the other side of that door. Maybe. Okay, Mr. Frank. Do this. Go check out that way. It's yeah, personally, I just develop strategies for every single UFO type and stuff. Yup. It. It's sick that I played this game that much, but. Probably, probably been years since you played this, huh? Oh, uh, no, I play it a lot if you look at my Steam account. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I, I tend to, yes, I, I do play a lot. I played the newer XCOM a lot now. This one was my original love. Uh, God, I played this game so much. I enjoyed the, the, the newer XCOM when it came out. XCOM 2 is good, and I play that a lot now. Uh, but... Yeah, my money, my money game is still this game. It's not the game I have the most hours on, but it's close. I think I play this game a lot outside of Steam, like the Steam version, because of the. Uh, I played it a lot outside of the Steam version as well. Like the special, like you know, like modern computers can play. It. You had to get the different fixes and all that. You kind get of the crap. patches that you put in the file folder. Yup. Been there, done that. Oh, well, that's. You just pop What's through that? the door and. Zzz. Okay. This should be it right here. And don't be a douchebag. Uh, or it... shoot yourself. Yeah. Given appearances, I believe Igor lived. Oh my. Someone else Unless... had to die. Unless there's another alien in here, which is possible. When rooms don't load like that. It always makes me nervous because mm -hmm. usually it's because there's an alien in there that's gonna shoot you. Yup. Oh, 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 where, where are you going? He's going outside. That's not the. Oh, oh he's going, going the outside. long way. Oh, this game's pathfinding could be better sometimes. It's I'll, amazing. I'll be honest. It's very good. I, you know, I guess maybe it's just I've just developed ways around the downsides of the game and maybe oh, that no. oh oh, oh no. <laughs> he oh. never fell unconscious he just died he just died no they're either hanging out by the control pad over here yep or they're inside that room yep. unless they're hanging out there yeah they could be waiting just inside this door as well sometimes they do that no, nope, he's in that room right there. Yup. Waiting to ambush you. Oh, let's get some guys close. <laughs> it, this is ultimately the time when you don't mind losing soldiers as much. In the beginning, yeah. Because they're all chumps, basically. Good enough. Once you start having time and effort invested into troops. It's the fact that like your troops can level and get better. Yeah. Like if, uh, if you have a troop uh, carry tons and tons of weight every time, their strength actually gets stronger. You know? Yep. I always thought that was really cool. They beef up. Yeah, I... There he is! I knew he'd be hiding in there. Oh, can you blow up the core? Uh, I don't think rifle's strong enough, but well, well, one way to find out, right? Yeah. Pew! First shot dropped him. Nice job. Good work, man. Is that it? You're a Are we done Joe. now? Real American hero. Better be. Okay. All done. Yay! Hooray! Oh, oh we get the cutscene. Yeah, we gotta find the plane jerk face. Yep, cross alien off. I forgot that this one has the cutscene. The <laughs> other one, the other XCOM dude. That's not stock. In the original computer game. All right, so you killed four aliens, you <coughs> covered their corpses, you got 14 artifacts, three operatives were killed, a tank was blown up, but.
But you did get a bunch of other good stuff. So you got a positive score. Oh. And you got a promotion. Good work, man. Well, I'm not kidding, because our tank. Yep, yep. You're going to have to go and buy another tank. Of course. Do that right now. Cause yeah, because it takes forever to get it. And you're going to get attacked again. And I would hire more soldiers, yep. because... This is where the balance comes in, especially early game. Of, like... You're constant in a constant state of replacing people and equipment. Sometimes you get lucky. Let's see. Oh, of course I can. Kind of hard to equip the Sky Engine and still fly back. Yeah. Fly faster. That's okay. We'll probably get our tank before another battle, right? You should. Hope so. If not, you can always bounce into your base and fill up the Sky oh, Ranger. Yeah, <laughs> That's alright. You still gotta shoot it down. Intercepted one, I believe in you. That's the base. <laughs> There's the UFO. Let's try again. Interceptor. Let's go and talk. Gets to UFO 5. Don't shoot it down too quick. Because so what's the highest UFO number you've gotten to on this game? Uh, I don't remember, but... It's several hundred. <laughs> That's awesome. You're talking the PlayStation version, version exclusively? Or just any version. On the PlayStation version, I remember getting over 100. Awesome. On the PC, it's like 3-something. PC's a lot easier. It's you know, the load times. Yeah. Much quicker to uh, uh -oh. to play. Yeah, yeah, shot that son of a bitch down. Take that. No. Yeah, we don't have a tank here. No, you do not. Oh. You're going to have to just throw what you got into the Sky Ranger. Like rockets. I don't want to do You got laser pistols. There. And you could put some more soldiers in there. Yeah, I'll definitely put some more soldiers in there. Take that small rocket out or else you'll have that loaded. It always puts that in as default. That's kind of silly. Isn't it? Yeah, it's still not a full Sky Ranger, but... That's less than optimal, but it's, you know what? It's better than it could have been. That's true. You realize you're going to take off, and then your tank's going to arrive, too. Oh, that's a oh. little... <laughs> one of those, like... Oh, hey, those guys' tank is here. Oh, they just took off. <laughs> you are ready to land near crash site 5. My body is ready. Yeah. And when we come back, we will start this mission. How does that sound? Sounds Work for you? great. All right. We will... Ca Ooh, excuse me. Catch you all the next time. Join us in our quest to 100 subscribers by clicking that button down below. Uh, we would appreciate it. And we'll see you all then. Check you later. Later. Winter sucks. Let's see what my phone says. 40 below. Uh, your ice cream is probably safer on your front porch than in your fucking freezer. <laughs> <laughs>